What began as a rescue has now turned into a recovery effort in Walker. This after a person went missing in the Grand River earlier today. The scene is along Veterans Memorial Drive north of Wilson. That's where News 8's Joe Lafergy joins us live with an update tonight. Joe. Yeah, Brian, still a pretty substantial first responder uh, action here at the uh, boat launch near Johnson Park. You see the Kent County Sheriff's Department dive team, Ottawa County Sheriff's dive team here as well out on the water. And this all started about 1130 this morning. Two people in a canoe out on the Grand River told dispatchers they saw a person go under the water but did not resurface. That brought dive teams from the Grand Rapids Fire Department, Georgetown Township Fire Department, as well as the Kent and Ottawa County Sheriff's Department to the scene. Now, GRFD spent a close to three hours searching the area. A couple that spotted the person that went underwater stayed with those dive crews, pointing them in the directions that they lost. They last saw that victim. Frustrating to me that we didn't see him sooner. Mm -hmm. It was just we just saw one look at him and it's mm -hmm. like, wow, where did he come from? It wasn't like we were we saw him coming towards us. Oh, there's a guy swimming in the river. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, one look, he was obviously in distress, and we couldn't get to him. Yeah, it's just sad, sad, very sad. No word on how long this search will continue. Now, Iowa County divers actually took a, an underwater robot into the water basically just ran into debris while they were down there. So we will have a crew on scene throughout the evening. We will keep you keep you updated both on air and online line. Live in Walker tonight, Joe Lafergie, News 8.